Uh, this is with Jamie Hooper here, Wisdom for Training. Uh, we've talked about iron palm, full iron forearm, uh, iron fingers. Uh, let's talk about iron body, okay? Uh, there's many ways to train. Let me give you the simplest, okay? Uh, you can take and make um, those uh, bags, mung beans, gravel, steel shot, river rock, and marble, all good. You can make the bag long, like, like a stick, fill it full, sew it up, and then it'd be kind of flimsy, and then of course you hit your body. Uh, and we're gonna talk about this conditioning, uh, the upper part of your body here. Um, now, I can talk to you about how to condition your throat. I can talk to you about how to condition your shins. But um, I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna go through just what, about the upper the body here, the torso. Okay, and uh, we're gonna deal with the size of the ribs and the abdomen, okay? And so what I do is that once you wanna do the bags and stuff, that's fine. But uh, I like to start off with this. This is a really good way to start out with conditioning your body. Um, you can do it by yourself. And if you do it by yourself, you take it here, breathe in and out, when you strike your ribs, and make sure that when you breathe out, that you kind of concave your ribs, tighten your ribs up, and then hit and let the air out. Now as you go, you can begin to hit yourself, and don't tense, you can be relaxed, okay? But at first, you need to build yourself up and be very careful, and so you can do it yourself. Simply, hit the top part, breathe. Hit the middle part, hit the lower, just like that. Switch hands, up, middle, lower, just like that, okay? Just that simple, just the rib cage. Now, if, uh, I'm gonna have to have it here for a second. Now, that was one of my advanced students. Now, if, if you, um, if, if I'm gonna hit Kevin, I want you to watch, I'm gonna hit him, I want you to do it like this. I'm gonna hit it right here, hands up on the side. I'm gonna hit the top, middle, low part. Just like that, okay? And you do both sides. So you do this side, high, middle, low. Just like that, okay? Now, same thing is true for the abdomen. Now watch, you have the low, middle, and the subtle flex. Subtle flex is always a problem with people. Now listen, here's the thing about iron body. There's always a gate, meaning that there is a part of you that's going to be weak. Now here's the key to the mastery of the iron body. Listen, the smaller the gate, the higher the level, okay? A lot of people don't tell you that. This is not iron body, all right? So understand, the smaller the gate, okay? If, if, you're, if, if, if the weakness, if you're weak in your soul flex, the smaller you can make that weakness, the, the higher the level of the iron body. If you're weak in your lower abdomen, the smaller you can make that particular area or weakness, the higher the level, okay? So if you can eliminate most of the weakness or the weak areas of your body, then the stronger the iron body will be, the stronger your body will be to resist attacks, okay? But now listen, this is not iron body. Doing that and letting somebody hit you is ridiculous, okay? You can toughen yourself up, but you've got to be able to resist these specialty strikes to the weak parts of your body. The solar flexes, even here. Now I ain't going to talk about how to toughen up the underarms, but I can tell you that later. I'm not going to do that now, so watch. Three levels of striking. Blow your out, Kevin. On high, high, and then medium, and then low. And then here, high, medium, low. Same thing with abdomen. Here, high, medium, low. See, low, right there. Hit low. Now, now you go from this, you can get one of these, and this is much more dangerous. Now watch, high, medium, low. High, medium, low. High, medium, low. Okay, this is much more difficult. You gotta be very careful. Make sure that you spend a very long time with one of these, okay? This is a Japanese, uh, they use it for um, uh, kendo practice, but I'll tell you, uh, what is this called? A shinai. A shinai, yeah. So you get one of these, it's really good, it's made out of bamboo, and it just bounces off just really good. Now you can beat your forearms, you can beat your hands, you can do all kinds of things to toughen your body up. And of course, you can hit your skin. That's just a 
part of the training. But right now, just focus on your, your uh, iron body, your rib cage, your abdomen, train hard, train safe, and be careful. And remember, not everybody really knows. Sometimes they pretend. Study hard and really know. Find a good teacher. Find a good teacher. Don't give up.